हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम बैक क्लास नाइन टुडे आई एम डिस्कसिंग अवर माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एस एक्सेल सो फर्स्ट वी स्टार्ट स्टार्ट ऑल प्रोग्राम्स माइक्रोसॉफ्ट ऑफिस एंड यू कैन सी दिस इज योर माइक्रोसॉफ्ट ऑफिस एक्सेल ओके वी कैन मैक्सिमाइज अवर विंडो सो यू कैन सी दिस इज अवर माइक्रोसॉफ्ट एक्सेल विंडो ओके बट टुडे आई एम गिविंग ए अवर प्रैक्टिकल एग्जाम्पल टू क्रिएट ए मार्कशीट ओके सो सिंपली वी कैन दिस इज अवर सेल पॉइंटर फर्स्ट वी सेलेक्ट मल्टीपल सेल ओके फर्स्ट वी सेलेक्ट मल्टीपल सेल ओके यू कैन सी सो हियर आई वॉन्ट टू सेलेक्ट मल्टीपल सेल ओके देन यू कैन सी दिस ऑप्शन मर्ज एंड सेंटर ओके मर्ज एंड सेंटर यू कैन सी दिस ऑप्शन इज अवेलेबल इन अवर होम होम टेप मर्ज एंड सेंटर ओके नाउ यू कैन टाइप बिकॉज मर्ज एंड सेंटर विल मर्ज मल्टीपल सेल एंड कन्वर्ट इन टू वन सेल एंड कर्सर विल पुट इन टू द सेंटर सो हेर एंड यूजिंग टाटा केम डी ए वी पब्लिक स्कूल हेर एंड यूजिंग मिठापुर ओके सो दिस इज अवर टाइटल एंड आफ्टर टाइपिंग वी कैन प्रेस एंटर टू Uh, exit from this cell then i want to bold this data okay then i want to increase the size suppose here i am giving 20 you can also change the handwriting we suppose here i am using uh, suppose uh, here i am using basker willy old face okay you can also change the color of this so here i am using uh, blue color okay so this is our a title okay now here i am selecting uh, next uh, second row multiple cell okay then here we can use merge and center again here i am using suppose class here i am using class 9 okay here i am using mark sheet okay we can use 2020 220 Uh, here I'm using 21. Again, press Enter. Okay. Now I want to select. I want to suppose bold and I want to give underline. Suppose I want to change the font size. Suppose I, here I'm selecting uh, 14. I want to give font color. Suppose here I'm giving. Uh, suppose here I'm giving uh, brown color. Okay. Uh, suppose here I am giving again I am giving blue color. Okay, so don't worry. So here you can see this is uh, our uh, bold italic underline and font you can change. Suppose Arial black. Okay, so here you can see first is our school name. Second we can use our uh, uh, the proper title. Uh, which thing I want to discuss? Okay. now i want to select this cell okay here i am using suppose roll number then press tab key then here i am using name then press tab key here i am using hindi then press tab key here i am using english then we can use math then we can use science then we can use suppose uh, social science okay then we can use it okay so these are our subject but social science you can see in our formula bar everything you can click suppose you click in this thing so it's same thing you can see in our title in our formula formula bar okay when you select here so same thing you can see in formula bar but social science data is not complete visible in this cell so here i'm using uh, i want to change the width I want to change the width of this column, so you can see properly. You can see, okay. Now I want to uh, center this data. So first we select this cell, and I want to use this option, okay, center, okay. I want to bold this thing, okay. So this thing you can see. So here I am using row number suppose one zero one. Then press enter. Here I am using name Amit. Marks of here I am consider hundred hundred marks out of hundred you can see eighty five English seventy five maths 
नाइन्टी फाइव साइंस यू कैन थिंक सिक्सटी फाइव सोशल साइंस यू कैन थिंक सपोज एट्टी फाइव इन आई टी यू कैन थिंक हंड्रेड ओके सो यू कैन सी बट फाइनली हियर आई एम यूजिंग टोटल ओके हियर टोटल नाउ हियर आई एम सेलेक्ट दिस लाइन एंड आई वॉन्ट टू सेंटर दिस डेटा बट आई वॉन्ट टू परफॉर्म टोटल ओके टोटल मीन्स एट्टी फाइव प्लस सेवेंटी फाइव प्लस नाइन्टी फाइव इज इक्वल टू सिक्सटी फाइव एट्टी फाइव हंड्रेड सो हेर आई एम यूजिंग इक्वल टू ओके हेर आई एम यूजिंग इक्वल टू बिकॉज एवरी कैलकुलेशन इन एक्सेल ऑलवेज स्टार्ट विथ इक्वल टू हेर आई एम यूजिंग सम फॉर्मूला एस यू एम एंड हेयर वी कैन यूज स्मॉल ब्रेकेट ओपनिंग देन वी कैन सेलेक्ट वी यूज सेलेक्ट द एक्चुअल डेटा फ्रॉम स्टार्टिंग हेयर and i want to stop here because this selected range i want to calculate sum then finally you can close this bracket and enter so you can see total is 505 okay students now here i want to click here this is our a5 cells a means this is our a column and fifth row here i am using 102 here i am using akash okay the marks of akash you can see Okay, here I am giving the marks of Akash in various subject. Okay, students. Now I want to center this data. I want to select this data and center this data, and I want to perform sum. So here again, here I am using is equal to. Then we can type sum. Then we can use small bracket opening. Then I want to select this range seventy five, ninety six, eighty two. Okay, this here you can select. Okay, then press enter. Okay, so you can see four double five. So I want to center this data. Okay, student. Here I am taking another student one zero three. Here I am using Rohit. Okay, so marks of Rohit you can see. Okay, marks of Rohit here I am inputting. Okay. Now you can see this is our marks of Rohit. I want to select. I want to center this data, and here I am using again is equal to sum and opening bracket, and the marks of Rohit 52, 96. Here I am selecting, then close the bracket, and then press enter. Okay, and I, I want to select. I want to center this data. Okay, student. Now here I am using again 104. Here I am using Nitin. so marks of nitin here i am inputting okay you can see the marks of nitin but i want to calculate total of nitin here i am using is equal to sum small bracket opening and i want to select the marks of nitin exactly then close the bracket then press enter okay now mark the total you can see so four For four twenty one, the total of okay. So again, here we have last student one zero five. Here I am using Smith. Okay, the marks of Smith you can see. Okay. Now you can see uh, here I am using is equal to sum opening bracket and I want to select from because sixty five cell address is C eight so directly we can use C eight okay C eight means I want to start from C eight here we can use colon colon means range from C eight to uh, we can say this is our H eight so we can mention H eight. so excel automatically select this range and then we can close the bracket and press enter so you can see the total of 548 now we can use maximum marks we can use maximum marks okay so you can see each subject is 100 100 100 100 100 100 100 so we can say this is our 600 okay this is our 600 so we can repeat same data you can use in corner a black plus you can see a black plus you can see and you can drag and drop you can drag and drop so you can see because 600 is the maximum mark of maximum marks of every student 
now finally i want to calculate percentage okay i want to calculate percentage so i want to increase the height increase the width for percentage we can use is equal to then we click or 505 okay then we click upon divide then we click 600 then we can multiply 100 okay so 505 upon 600 multiply 100 so it will give this percentage again i am using equal to we can click on 455 so it will give the cell address i5 upon we can click 600 then we can multiply 100 so then you see see the percentage of uh, akash now i want to calculate the percentage of rohit so here i am using is equal to then we can use 449 four, we can use divide then we can click on 600 then we can use uh, multiply by 100 then we can press enter here i want to calculate the percentage of nitin so here i am using is equal to 421 upon 600 multiply by 100 then we can press enter and last student you are smith so again here i am using is equal to 458 upon 600 multiply by 100 then we can press enter so you can see so here i am also calculating the percentage now you when you click the 505 in total so you can see the formula is equal to sum from c4 to h4 you can double click and see the formula then we can press enter maximum marks we directly input percentage you can see here is equal to i4 means 100 upon i4 uh, i4 means 505 upon j4 j4 means 600 so you can see this is our percentage okay students now i want to select this data using this white mouse pointer and i want to give border okay so you can see this is our border okay now i want to change the heading color title so here i am using blue you can change the color so we can use red color okay now i want to give different color of first student so i want to select okay i want to select this line exactly then we can select another color suppose light color here i am taking okay here then we select this line then we can select another light color suppose okay so you can we, we can say this we can format our data okay we can format our data according to our choice then select this line then we give another uh, light color and this is our last line so i want to select and give a another interesting color okay now you can see we have different kind of colors okay so this is the main purpose of excel now finally i want to create the chart okay so first you can you, you can select roll number suppose here i am select only name and marks of hindi only two things exactly you can select name and hindi marks okay then we click on insert then we select our uh, uh, in insert you can see charts so first i am selecting 2d column so here here i am selecting first chart okay so you clearly see amit akash rohit nitin smith and you can see the marks of hindi clearly you can see marks of our hindi okay uh, so you can see this is the marks of our hindi now i want to delete this chart again okay now i want to see name hindi english i want to see name in ox axis hindi english marks in oy axis so here here i want to select this data and again insert and chart so here i am using this chart so here you can see here uh, this color show hindi marks and this color show english marks so comparative you can see each and every amit you can see 80 and this marks akash you can see hindi and english marks rohit you can see hindi and english marks nitin you can see hindi or english marks smith you can see hindi and english marks okay so this this is our column chart so uh, after when you select this column chart so another tab you can see design layout and format tab you can see but in design tab we can change the format of our chart okay you can select this style chart okay you you can select this style chart okay so different kind of we can select 
or then we can select this chart we can delete our chart suppose you want to select name hindi english maths three things so you can select insert then we have several thing we can use 3d column chart also so we can perform 3d column chart and uh, design day we can change our 3d style we can use another things okay students so chart we will discuss uh, later more chart we will discuss so today i am giving an example how to give proper title how to create insert data how to perform sum how to perform percentage and how to create a simple chart based on our data okay students thank you so much